up everybody welcome back to another video um, as you guys can see we have gotten our Anatole equipment this video is going to come out after I've already set everything up so you guys have probably already seen everything set up what we're going to do in this video is we're going to uncrate the flash dryer and we're going to set it up so I can show you guys if you're interested on how it comes crated and how to set it up so let's go ahead and get started and so right here we have the flash dryer and then over here is the stand for it and so what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and uncrate the stand before we uncrate the flash dryer so let's go ahead and start knocking this out but here's how it looks whenever it's inside of the crate so as you can see everything inside the crate is secure has these little brackets right here on this side this side right here and then down here holding this t part which is going to hold the flash dryer in place so let's go ahead and finish taking this apart all right so that's it we got all the screws out of here let's go ahead and open this one up see what it looks like okay so here it is the rapid flash dryer i'll get the right name for it eventually but here it is right here um, same thing with this one this one says fragile because there's actually bulbs in here so this one has a lot of padding in here just to keep it if it were to be bounced around or whatever um, i can see right here we have the hookup for it and then the instructions so each one of these came with instructions i didn't show you for the six by six or the conveyor dryer but it comes with its own little booklet with instructions on how to put it together. So the right ways and the wrong ways. So we're going to go ahead, finish taking all these screws out of here. And then we'll pull this out and get ready to put it on the stand. We got this thing all taken apart. Let's go ahead and get this thing out of here without dropping it. Because you don't want to break those bulbs in there, right? So we're going to go ahead. This is... So I'm going to lay it back down the same way they had it because just to be on the safe side. We're going to go ahead, we're going to go ahead and mount this on here. So this is a 17 millimeter right here. We're just going to go ahead and take these off so that we can put the on the base so now I got the bolts off we're gonna go ahead and put this piece on there just the upright they call this the upright upright bracket is what they call it so we're gonna put the upright bracket on here install these four bolts back on here um, I was thinking maybe it, you did, it didn't matter which way you put this but I guess it does because back here in the back you can see right here there's a little screw right here, so I'm not sure what that is yet, but we'll figure it out whenever we get there. All right, so for this next part, we're going to go ahead and we're going to attach these two arms right here. All right, so now that we've got these two arms on here, we're going to go ahead and we're going to grab the actual flash dryer. And the good thing about it is it has tubes where this that flash dryer will slide right on here so we're going to go ahead we're going to do that this right here is the sensor so that whenever you move your pallet over it automatically will turn the flash dryer on so it doesn't have to constantly stay on so we're going to go ahead and put this piece on here right now is yours in the tube mm -hmm. slide it back. All right, so if we look right here, we have a little lever. We could loosen this lever up right here. And you have this on top. As you either move this left or right, this thing will go up or down. So that's cool that you can adjust your height a whole lot easier with, um, with this right here. And then once you get it where you want it, you will then just tighten up the little lever again so that it won't move on you. 
And then another thing you want to do is you want to make sure that you slide this all the way to the back because you have this little lever right here. Once you slide this back, you're going to tighten this right here to hold this in place. All right, so that's it. I wanted to take you guys through the process on how this thing came crated. Whenever we took the top piece off, I showed you the way everything was secure in there. Nothing was moving around. And then whenever we got to this piece right here, that they did have some padding in there just in case it did get bumped. So I want to take you guys through the process of that and then um, the setting, setting it up. So as you guys saw, this thing was really easy to set up. Nothing hard about it. I think we put together four, six, eight, ten bolts. 10, 11 bolts. It only took 11 bolts to put this thing together, so it's not really hard. So if you are interested in one of these flash dryers, you now know how they come crated and the process on how putting it together. So it wasn't hard. There it is. So I just want to say uh, the next video you guys will see whenever we start putting everything in here, um, getting it set up and then getting ready to print something, right? So I just want to say thank you guys for watching another one of my videos. And until next time, keep pressing.